Hello and welcome back. Another little quick one. If anyone's familiar with Beaton Plaza in Liverpool city centre, you will know it has some really nice bucket fountains sort of display there. Currently under threat by new developers. I think the new developers want one away with it and sort of apartments built on where it used to be. So there's a bit of a petition and an online sort of campaign to save these fountains. And just walking around the side of uh, St. J well, James Street Station. Not St. James's Station, that's up by Parliament Street. So I'm just going to take you up to these little fountains which are currently working. I'm just going to show you them in action. So when I was a kid, uh, we used to come down here on our, on our bikes, just have a ride round and just sort of stop, stop here and just uh, take, take this in. They were working at the time we come. Yeah, I'm going back uh, early 80s, late 80s. So these are the ones that are sort of under threat at the moment. So what I'm told is that they want, well, they want to get get rid of all this and build apartments here. So I don't know how true it is, but you know, yeah, good times, eh? Bloody good times. I think at the time I had a rally grifter. He snuck for me, mate. Shieldsy down Warwick Street, and we'd all um, we'd all bail down here. Just hanging around here for a bit on our bikes. Yeah, it's pretty sad to see this go if it does. Hopefully this campaign will uh, come into effect. And it'll all be stopped. Yeah, let's have a little read of this sign here. Yeah, save the bucket fountain in its current location and protect public open space. Gifted to the people and city of Liverpool or built by apprentices at Camelards. Designed by Richard Hughes, the world's greatest designer of sound sculpture fountains. Maintained for 20 years by local residents. So there's the thing there to sign and Facebook page as well. Pretty cool. I don't ever remember it being that loud, like, but... Here's one. Ah, oh, this one here is filled up. I'm gonna get soaked by the looks of it. Wait for a couple more. I think that these fill from those little things there. Must fill from there on the inside of these pipes. Just miss getting a soak in there.
the obligatory graffiti. There's Alec. You do get a bit of spray if you stand there. This one's ready to go, isn't it? There we have the bucket fountains. Been here since the 1960s. Oh yeah, look, it's full of freaking washed up liquid. The witch? On which? Let's go and have a look at the other one. Oh, on your microphones? There's an Eric. Right, viewing platform number two. Yeah. Right, so that was a look at the bucket fountains. Hopefully, they get saved.